Hi, I'm E. Christopher Clark from GeekForce5.com, and this is Behind the Comics. Comics don't belong in a closet. It's a conclusion I'm coming to. Uh, it's a conclusion I've, I've come to a long time ago, but comics do not belong in a closet like this one. Um, and I'm thinking about that today because of the announcement that I posted earlier in the day on Geek Force 5 about graphically getting access to Marvel Comics and bringing Marvel Comics digitally to your desktop. Uh, I've been wanting for a very long time an iTunes for comics. Maybe it's just me, but I would like to be able to read all the comics that are in the boxes that are down here. I'm not even sure if you can see all these boxes. All these boxes of comic books right here. Um, not any boxes, nothing in here. I think there's copies of my first book are in there. But uh, all these comics, all those comics are basically sitting in my closet right now. And that is not where comics belong. Comics should be out. They should be getting read. So I'm going to get rid of some of these, try to get them to people who will read them. But there's a lot of them that I would like to read. There's a lot of them I would like to have again. And if I had them in an iTunes-like interface digitally on my computer or synced to my phone to iBooks, that would be awesome. Unfortunately, the comic book companies are only providing bits and pieces of their collection, of their backlog, and they're never offering new comics, as far as I can tell, at least not on any regular basis. This needs to change. They need to get standard about it. I want all the comics that I've ever owned digitally, right? I could scan them. That would take fucking forever. I, want, I would buy them again. Give them to me at 99 cents a pop, $1.99 a pop. I won't buy everything that I've bought ever, but I'll buy a lot of the stuff that I bought. Um, and let me buy new issues digitally. I don't have room in my house for comic books. I, I have room for them, but not room to put them in a place where I can access them regularly. Comic books do not belong in closets. I want my comic books out of the closet. That's what I'm thinking about today on Behind the Comics. I am E. Christopher Clark from GeekForce5.com. And I'll catch you on the flip side.